We've made a few videos on how we use Canva to make beautiful websites. There's so many different templates. You can play around and make so many different types of websites. It is amazing. You can actually be as creative as you'd like. Now, they are not blog style. They are definitely more informational or store style. You can link to other places if you have a Shopify or if you have um, a big cartel or an Amazon storefront, you can do that as well. But what's really great about Canva is it's so simple to use and you can also connect your custom domain. Now, if you're just a regular Canva member, the not paid subscription, you can have your subdomain. But if you're a Canva Pro member, you can take a domain that you already have and you can go ahead and add it, which is really, really nice. So this is one of my websites here. I'm just going to go ahead and play around and edit. And once I'm finished, I can go and I can hit publish. And that really, again, just makes it so simple. I can edit quickly, publish, and republish quickly, by the way. Once you have your website, it's super easy to republish. So now I'm going to go to publish website and I'm going to pick a URL. I actually have my own domain, so I went to get domain. You can bring your own and that's how you do it. Type in your domain, which I use Namecheap for. I love Namecheap. Really great domain servicing. I love their backend and I'll show you a little bit about what that looks like, but I type it in. And from here, you're going to go ahead and connect manually. You have name, host, and value points to. You want to copy each one individually and go to your back end in Namecheap or your GoDaddy or wherever you're getting your domain and you go to advanced DNS. So I copy name host, go to my advanced DNS, select a record, put in host, go back to Canva, value points to copied that long number, go back to my back office, go ahead and add in the value and click OK. Then you're going to go back to Canva, hit record added and then start a new one. So I need to create an A record to link the subdomain. So I hit copy for name host A record, create a new A record, put in the host, go back to Canva, get that IP address, boom, copy, put it in the IP address and hit OK. Then I'm going to go back to Canva and go to record added and then the next one, which is a TXT record, copy that name host, add down by the TXT, add yes, go ahead and add that add the value points, go ahead and add that. I already had one in there, but I'm gonna go ahead and redo it. There you go, and now you have your TXT record record added. I've updated and used the domain. Once that's all in there, you go ahead. You, I have a few, so I'm gonna go ahead and select the correct one, but if you only have one, you should be fine, and hit publish. It will take a few seconds to do this, but once you're done, it typically only takes I'd say a few minutes. If it takes longer than an hour or a couple hours, you might want to recheck and make sure you did everything correctly. That's pretty much it. You could even do the preview right then and there and see what it's going to look like. But again, it could take a couple of hours. Usually me, it only takes about an hour or so. If you want to check your work, go to the little wheel at the top and you can go to domains and see everything is hooked up and ready to go. It's really simple to check on it. You can actually see that they're connected and you can view from there. I absolutely love using Canva to make our websites. And then when people go to my domain, it looks like a professional non-subdomain type website that you can go ahead and just use and enjoy and send out, put on your business cards, put on your social media and so much more. So definitely check out Canva for creating websites. I hope this tutorial was pretty easy. You can slow it down, go back. I had to actually look at it a couple times for myself because I wasn't sure how to use the advanced DNS, but it's really simple. Go to your advanced DNS in your domain provider and just copy those steps. It's just one, two, three, and you're good to go. And then you just have your site. It's really awesome, really easy. I hope you enjoy Canva and I hope you enjoy the websites. Have a lot of fun and be creative. It really does make a difference in branding and just being able to, especially if you're a Canva Pro member, get so much value out of one subscription. I pay for this subscription because I get so much value. I get websites, I get graphics, I get so many enjoyable things out of this one subscription. I love it. So if you like this video, give it a big thumbs up, subscribe if you're new, and we'll see you in the next one.